I am Anil Kumar and this video is for my student Raneem. Raneem, we have been discussing about pattern rules for blocks and here is a very interesting question for you. The question is, create a pattern for which algebraic expression n square might be a pattern rule. So you can pause the video and create a couple of patterns where n square might be a pattern rule. Okay, now what does n square mean? So when we are trying to make pattern rules and we are making with the blocks, let me say uh, this is our uh, figure number one and then we'll draw figure number two here and then we'll draw figure number three and this could be extended to figure number n. So n is any number of figures. That is what n is for us, right? Now, when I say that the rule is n square, that means the number of blocks I have here is, is how many? In this case, n is 1, right? So, it will be 1 times 1, O which is 1. 2 means 2 times 2, that means 4 blocks. And here I have to make something with 3 times 3, that means 9 blocks. So, what you can do is, you can take out your blocks and just put one block here, four here, nine here, and likewise, next will be 16 blocks, right? And make some pattern using these blocks. Now, to give you an idea, uh, basically, n square, you know, is square of a square, right? So, what we could do here is, we could make uh, one square, right? So, if I make one square, then the area is one, or you can say it's just one square and now you can extend this so you already have one square now what you do is that you can extend the sides of the square by one on each side so if you extend and form a bigger square then how many squares can you make right check it out it is indeed four right right so we can extend this particular structure and let me make the third one here and you can try making uh, two more of the same kind. So what we did in the previous one is that we extended it correct, by one unit on length, one on the width. This time in the third case, in the third figure we will extend it by one more unit on length and width of the square. So what do we get? We get a structure like this. Can you tell me how many squares are there in this particular figure? Let's count it. So if I join this kind of, right? If you are playing with your blocks, you can exactly know what we are trying to do. Well, it is indeed 9, 3 times 3. So that could be a pattern. And this pattern is defined by the rule, which is n squared. Do you get the idea? So now here we have a pattern rule, which is n squared. Can you think about some other way of creating uh, figures in the form of a pattern, a sequence, where n square may be applied? Okay, let's think about it. Let's again start with uh, one square. So I'll again start with one square. So we could do it like this. We have one square and now we have four. Uh, let us say one and I need to place these three. Uh, since I know that we need four, what I can do is I can place them right like this, correct? So we can place them like this. Okay, that makes it four, right? It didn't come out so well, but in any case, you get the point, right? So you have one square here. I think this time is going to be better. So we had uh, uh, four square previously, right? So these are my one plus three. And now I have... Uh, five more to go. So what I will do is I will place them in this fashion. So that is kind of interesting. So likewise, if you play with these blocks, it is easier to make some patterns and understand their rules. So if you count one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So you do get a pattern with nine blocks. So what you see here is that the number of blocks are one, four, nine, 16, 25 and so on and this sequence of blocks could be represented by 
an algebraic expression n squared you understand now so n square means n if it is 1 1 times 1 if it is 2 2 times 2 and if it is 3 3 times 3 and you can continue this for a couple of more figures and see it for yourself that if you have 100 blocks how many figures can you make like this I hope that this you find this interesting thank you and all the best